New tonight, a church along Greenville Boulevard needs repairs. It's after a small fire damaged part of its roof this evening. We brought you this first live on WNCT 9 News at 6 o'clock. Now to your signs, Adriana Hardgrove joins us in the studio after digging deeper into the situation. So Adriana, what's the latest tonight? Pastor Gene Williams of Parker's Chapel Free Will Baptist Church says during today's storm, he witnessed one of two main power lines had fallen right by the church's offices. Now, this was that scene earlier. Williams says he's just glad by the grace of God that the fire didn't spread throughout the church. After both power lines broke, Pastor Williams says all of a sudden he and some of the members of the church could smell smoke. The Lord, as always, he watches out for his people and watches over us and uh, just he had his hand on us. He had his hand in what was going on. And so he, he certainly provided great care for us in the midst of all of this. Now, Pastor Williams adds he's grateful for all the fire departments and Greenville Utilities Commission responding to the scene and immediately getting the fire under control. Now, Williams says regular church services will resume this weekend if most of the smoke is out of the sanctuary. If not, services will take place in the Family Life Center. Now, Greenville Police was redirecting traffic while crews worked in the area. Last time we checked, the area between 10th Street and Pactolis Highway was closed, along with Old Pactolis Highway. In studio, Adriana Hart. Grove 9 on your side. Adriana, thank you.